are playing with the hottest kind of fire there is. A gentle touch, that fiery kiss, and the look of yearning desire. Now all at the tip of your fingers with passion flicks. You are the only one who's ever been my lover in the truest sense. A hot and steamy streaming service that takes romance novels to the screen. I get a lot of inspiration from all these romance novels. I love them so much and I feel like we can, every single person can grow just from reading a romance novel. The force behind all of this, Tosca Musk. Yes, Elon's sister. You know, the great thing about passion flicks and romance novels is that you know that you're going to go through this emotional roller coaster. You might cry, laugh, be scared, but at the end, you know you're going to have this happy ending. Rapidly gaining popularity, this year alone, romance book sales topped 19 million, up 40% from last year. It literally only takes one person to get it right. It's what women want to read and watch. Sex, I think, is a lot of times something seen from a male point of view. And what we want to do is we want to create movies very much so focused on the woman's point of view. We tend to be more emotionally connected. The company founded by Musk and two other partners in 2017 is a subscription-based service for $5.99 a month. Do you feel like you're competing with Netflix, Hulu, other streaming services? I don't see us as competitors. We are a unique platform that focuses very specifically on romance novel adaptations. The 48-year-old founder says she got her first real taste of the genre as a teenager. I used to, you know, watch Danielle Steele movie adaptations with my mom or Judith Krantz adaptations when we were younger. And talking about your mother, has she been a huge inspiration to you and has she been very supportive? My mother is the most incredible woman in the world, very supportive in every way and a, a constant inspiration. Her mother, the legendary model Mae Musk, an icon in her own right. The 74-year-old has graced the covers of Vogue and Sports Illustrated, just to name a few. Sometimes as a woman you feel like you, there's no hope for you in life. There's no romance, there's nothing good going on. And then when you get into a romance novel, you just get absorbed in the story. She says it was the pages of those novels that gave her an escape from what she says was an abusive marriage. I was reading them mostly was when I was married and um, I wasn't allowed to have friends or see families. I just read them to think that there is some hope in this world. Eventually, May left her husband, starting over as a single mother. What do you think is the biggest misconception about your family? That we were born into extreme wealth and we don't actually work for everything that we do, whereas that is the exact opposite. The days of the family sharing a small apartment are behind them. Elon Musk is now the richest person in the world. The Tesla and SpaceX CEO recently buying Twitter, a move that has been mired in controversy. They're normal siblings when we're all together, they, and Kimball and Tosca certainly don't want to take on the challenges that Elon does, and neither do I. I mean, it's taking on huge responsibilities worldwide, and we're so proud of him. I have such a, an amazing family, and everyone's so supportive, and we spend as much time as we possibly can together, and we like to get our kids together as much as possible. Tosca, without a leading man of her own, chose to become a mother to twins at 38. So often we settle for somebody because we are pressured to have children by a certain age. And so what I decided to do is to have children with in vitro and anonymous sperm donor. My children are the love of my life. Best decision I ever made was my children. We met Tosca in Atlanta on the set of the romantic thriller The Secret Life of Amy Benson. We're turning this into the Metropolitan, Metropolitan Museum of Art. So it'll be a very different look in about four or five hours. Strong female leads like the character Amy Benson are a hallmark of any passion flicks project. And no one takes it as seriously as proud passionistas. You were talking about the fans. You call them passionistas, right? We do, the passionistas. Passion Flicks has to be the eighth wonder of the world. 24-year-old Emma Carter's TikTok account, an ode to all things romance. These books really showcase different types of people falling in love, having experiences. You, There's so many that deal with like personal growth and overcoming different types of trauma. It's just really nice to pick up something and learn something about yourself along the way. She is one of the many proudly sharing her love of romance on social media. For the first, I think, three years of Passion Flakes, my mother was running our Instagrams. I said, you've got to get onto Instagram. Then we're going to start posting the photos. And then I think I got up to 
Was it 6,000? I mean, in those days, that was a lot. May Musk now has more than 620,000 followers on Instagram and over 800,000 on Twitter, where she is a passionate defender of her son, Elon. It's gone up a lot just in the last few days because I'm, well, I'm spending more time on it and I'm trying to add some humor as well. Tosca is also having fun doing what she loves, betting that romance will stay hot for years to come. I'd like us to be a household name. I want everybody to know about Passion Flicks. I want people to decide that on a weekend when they want to watch something positive and fun and sexy and cool that they're going to come and they're going to turn on Passion Flicks. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.